so we often get newbies asking about starter strips <laughs> this is a quick video on how I do it I have a wax box that has all my sheets of wax in it because you always end up with spares and then if I ever cut any wax to fit in the frame I keep all the off cuts and then I simply push them I don't fix them in any way I push them into the frame and then brush them fix them in place with melted wax it's not very pretty but the bees will clean it all up and fill that super full of uh, their own produce of wax which helps if you ever want to sell it as cut comb because you've got no real foundation in it so these four have still got to be glued with wax as you can see four minutes in the microwave to melt the wax and then we just simply paint it so we've got our melted wax in the little pot there and we literally just brush on some wax along the join the brush goes hard by the way but you're not really using it as a brush as such just something to uh, transfer the wax from the tub to the frame do both sides Save you wasting any of that wax that you uh, collect over months or years. And that's basically a super done. As you see, the wax doesn't have to cover the full frame. As long as it's there, just to give the bees an indication of where you want them to build. Saves uh, having cross combing and all sorts. Even if you didn't have any wax foundation, you could get yourself some wax out of the hive. I've even bought it off eBay before now and uh, just melt it down. I reckon if you was just to paint the top bar in melted wax, that would uh, let the bees know where you want them to build. And that's the finished super. 10 frames, probably took me about 3-4 minutes to do the lot. All we've started strips in. I'll put that on the back fast bees this afternoon, as long as it don't rain of course.